Is it corny if I start at my front door? I'm going to. Hi guys, it's me, Shelby. This is my house. You care because I'm Shelby. Um, anyways, I hate solicitors. I'm such a bah humbug. And I'll only open the door if it's a package. Mm -mm. Mm, that shit recognizes faces. It's just kind of creepy, but it'll be like, Jeremy's here when my best friend comes. So I'm like, oh, I guess I'll answer the fucking door. Anyway, so this is Mikasa. I thought the light would last longer, but it seems like I'm fighting with the sun right now. So yeah, I don't know the best way to show you. I guess it would just be like walking around with you like this. Or maybe it would be better if it was like this. I don't know, y'all wanna see my face or not? Anyways, <clears throat> I guess I could do this, right? But I like to see my pretty face when I'm looking at shit. So anyways, I, I'm gonna tell you a little something first. In college, I used to call this the sugar shack. Um, it's not really the sugar shack anymore. It's just like my creative la la land. And like I said, I'm, I don't really like people, so I stay in my house and just kind of um, hang out with Bay and do my thing. I don't know. All right, so this is like my workout room studio. Um, right now it's like I'm painting. I don't know. I don't look at that. But like I paint. I have like my singing bowls and my books. Um, you know, one time I had a guy here to uh, spray for bugs or something, and he saw this, and he's like, so you have a sex swing? That's cool. And I'm like, um, nah, it's like an acrobatic silk thing, not necessarily a sex swing, even though you, like, yeah, okay. Uh, pole and my workout equipment and my mirror. Sometimes I take photo shoots in here, and I have, like, my lighting and shit. I've like sat at this table, maybe I can count on both of my hands. I hate, like this is like one of my first pieces of furniture, but I never ever sit at the table. I don't know what it is. Mm, the kitchen. You know, I'm also really proud of my house because I remodeled it. So it's like I designed it. Like I, I put in the countertops. I did the handles. I did the hardware and the sink and the, you know, the stove and the fridge. So like I've been, you know, kind of working away. Um, this is quartz, which I love because as a little witch, my, my little witchy heart is like so happy to have like quartz amplifying my house and stuff. Hi, Bae. You're so nosy. Um, also, okay, so kitchen is like a little loop. My couch, man, hey, man, hey, friend, I sit here all the fucking time. I, well, I, let me tell you. This dog right here ripped up this cushion, and I love this couch so much that I got this cushion restuffed, but this cushion is so fucking hard. So I never sit here, but I always, always, always sit. You can't see nothing. I always sit here and it's so indented. I need a new couch and I'm really trying to get one of those like beautiful long sectionals, white, beautiful sectional, but I'm hesitant because beast over there makes everything dirty, like everything. And then also, because all the ones I've looked at don't really fit in this space and so I have to get a custom one and I'm like, okay, that's fine, I'll do that, but I just haven't gotten around to it. I love plants, I love, love, love them. We never watch movies on my TV, we always watch pictures on my TV for some reason. I just don't like watching movies or TV. Um, I love my dream board, I have it here to look at every day. You know, all kinds of shit. My traveling and fashion and my women's group and my um, all my awards for my music and my crowd and my dream car and my dream house and boat and jet and all kinds of stuff. Um, I usually have candles and stuff burning, but I don't have candles right now. All right, she's been following me around. Um, 
I'm also very proud of my yard because I also re-landscaped it and designed it myself. I switch from my slippers to my outdoor shoes because that, but also, oh shit, kill myself every time. I cannot keep my forest clean because of this bees, so I almost don't even try anymore and I just wear sandals. I mean, I sweep and stuff, but like, to like really, really care, I just don't. Anyways, this is my yard I'm very proud of because like I said, um, I landscaped, I picked all the um, plants and um, the the shape and you know how they're gonna do this and the planter and what color they're painting it and I, I gardened all of it like I don't have a gardener I do all the maintenance which says a lot because none of it's done with all these pine cones and all the weeds out here like I've been neglecting so much shit but anyways like I've been the one wrapping these you know this one's growing more because it's in a better sunlight but that's my jasmine fucking weeds I really got to get out here it's spring it's a perfect time to be uh, oleanders paracanthas I can't wait till these babies grow across the wall they're like thorny beautiful um, plants that grow up and eventually it'll like make me look like I have a jungle because it'll all be green and no one's gonna want to jump it because it's gonna be thorny as fuck so privacy um, yeah Oh, uh, fuck, I forget what these are called. Something lilies. They're beautiful. Mm, doo -doo -doo. Turf, I had a hissy fit. I wanted real grass, but I'm trying to be a little more eco-friendly and save water. I do live in a desert. Is that a weed? Oh, hell no, we're not doing that. Uh-uh, I'm coming out here later. Look at these, isn't this cute? I like succulents, yeah, I have some inside. They're not really great, like, oops, <laughs> I'm like hurting them. It's like re-blooming and I think it's just so damn adorable how it's just like little clusters like that. I didn't know that's how, that's how they do their thing, but I love it. Anyways, I love all the new growth on all my garden. This is lavender, I really gotta come out here and get rid of all this nastiness. I know, I'm gonna come out and like really take care of my garden here in a second. I'm like noticing how much I've been neglecting it. This is eucalyptus. Mm, I love silver dollar eucalyptus. This is a crane merle. She's so beautiful, but I guess she's like a little timid because of the weather and I don't blame her. Lavender, gotta really fix that up. These are redwood ferns, I believe. Not ferns. Oh, fuck. I forget what they are. But my lemon tree. And then this is broccoli. This is what broccoli looks like if you don't harvest it. Did you know that? Oops. Did I just, like, flick a bee? I don't know. Um, but anyways, like a cute little yellow flower. I got to eat some of it. Let's see? Little broccolis. But I really didn't harvest it in time. This is garlic, beets, let's see, thyme. I wish you can smell this because it smells so bomb. Rosemary, lavenders, ooh, it's getting chilly. And I also compost. This is really nasty. I might show you, well, I'm going to show you. Yeah, compost. Bugs out. It's a tumble composter, so I kind of got to do it myself. But that's the thing. Hey, Nosy. You a punk. I love to bonfire. I'm actually bonfiring tonight with my girl. It is Chile. I'm going back inside. Doggy door. Ooh. And back over my dog's name is bay all right i have a humidifier because it's so damn dry here in vegas and it's important take care of your skin and your eyes uh guest bathroom but also it's really just my wig room um yeah i got more wigs but these are the ones that i actually like 
wear. Um, yeah. Hey, that's me. Yep. And this is my studio. Oh, I guess that's not a good idea to do. Yeah, this is where I make YouTube videos, but I normally have this rolled up and that there. And I talk on my YouTube channel, but I was having a photo shoot. Um, yeah, I want to post the pictures really bad, but your girl has really bad OCD and the colors just don't work for, like, what's happening on my IG right now. Anyways, so yeah, that's where a lot of my little magic happens. Um... Let's see. My bedroom. It's kind of dark. That didn't help at all. Kind of like the floors, I can't keep my mirrors clean because this bitch, as soon as I clean my mirror, she comes in and shakes and her spit and slobber goes everywhere. Anyways, that's her bed, my bed. I love this art by these pink lips. Um, this is my music studio, so I stay jamming. Um, yeah, stay jamming. I also kind of designed my bathroom, and I love it. I hope it's clean. I did not clean anything because I was trying to be real, but um, yeah, keep my makeup and. I love this, like, forever mirror thing. Yo, forever in my affirmations. All right, so this is my shower. Or I think this is cute. I keep all my face mask ingredients, and I make my lotion and stuff, and dry brush, and extra towels, and toilet paper, and a book, you know, and, you know, wipes to keep yourself fresh. So I like to have a see-through shower because I don't know, I always think if a killer is going to come in and get me, I want to see him through the damn mirror and not be able to see because I have a foggy ass mirror and like the, um, what's his face? The guy who uh, put together my bathroom, the labor, um, uh, I can't I, fuck I can't think of the word he was like no you want to have a foggy one for privacy I'm like no because when whoever's sleeping with me can see me naked when I shower that's fine but like I want to see if somebody's creeping up on me plus my dog is cute and I always see her like doing goofy shit um Oh, I totally need a new producer. My guy has been sleeping on me hella hard and it pisses me off because he gasses me up and then he sleeps on me and it's fucking annoying as shit. Anyways, so I love this shower. I, like I said, I designed it. I'm really bougie with my shampoo and shit. I like this to, you know, put your leg up and shave, but also if you wanna get naughty, I definitely put that into consideration. Um, also, double-headed shower because, you know, when you're, like, taking a shower with your lover and, like, you're fighting over the water, yeah, that's not gonna happen. And I put it extra high so I can have a tall lover man because I love tall men. But anyways, that's kind of not been in use, so that's sad. But anyways, life goes on. <clears throat> uh, hey, bae. Anyways, we're good going we're going and we're going and we're going and just when you think i was perfect <sighs> i'm not i don't know why but i have this guest bedroom and i do my laundry but like i just do so much with my life that i do my laundry and then I throw my clean clothes on this guest bed and then every time I come in here I have a meltdown and wish I put my clothes away and then when I have time to put my clothes away I'm just like oh hell no that's intimidating and so I don't um anyways I don't live with anyone, and this is just my empty guest bedroom, so I just close the door and avoid it, like some of my other problems. 
Um, but yeah, I keep like paint and stuff in here, my Yanni steam stuff in here, um, wig stuff, clothes that I'm not wearing, um, you know, stupid shit. My diploma up there because I don't care. Um, it's cool, but like again, I don't care. Garage. Hey, it's sexy Lexi! And garbage and I don't know, miscellaneous shit. Laundry. That's it. Honestly, that's Mikasa. That's my baby. I come home to her every day. And I just love her so much. Anyways, I told her that I would take her to the place that's spelled with a A R K and it sounds like bark but starts with a P. Anyways, I can't say that word anymore because she's like really damn smart. Like so smart, it's ridiculous. Anyways, that was me cousin. Like I said, I'm proud of it because like I um I modeled it. I, I made the outside, the inside. I even did the front yard, but like I don't need to show you my street because y'all are going to pull it up on Google Maps and I'm going to open the door and see your all faces and I'm going to be like, what the fuck? So anyways, this is probably the closest you'll ever get to being invited over to my house because I am so antisocial. Like, I don't like people over in my space. I don't like people in my house, really, like... Um, anyways, yeah, like, I really just have my best friend over, not even my family so much, because, like, I don't really like all of them, um, but, yeah, it's just, like, if I really fuck with you, I'll have you over, but people are always, like, you show parties, I'm, like, no, no, no. I don't do energy I don't know in my house. I don't fucking like that shit. Like, I used to have roommates, and I used to go off on the fact that they would leave dishes in my sink. Like, I'm a little crazy. Like, I'm very paranoid about my space. Like, don't touch my shit. Um, and like I said, like, I got, I got my <laughs> art and workout studio. I have my music studio. I have my um, photo room, like, I don't need to leave, like, I have my garden, I have my dog, like, I'm, I'm cool, I journal, I doodle, I don't know, my friend came over and was like, were you mad, I was like, I wasn't mad, I was just fucking watching motivational shit and getting bored, <laughs> I'm just smoking and chilling, journaling, figuring out what my next YouTube video is gonna be about, yeah, exactly. Trying to live my best life. <sighs> but, yeah. This my crib. I, I mean... It's, like, cute. I love it. I mean, I can always upgrade, and I'm always upgrading it. But I'm very pleased. And blessed. Anyways, thanks so much for tuning in to my show of cribs i'm gonna upload this on my youtube channel so you can watch it there too if you're ever like i don't know why you would want to honestly i like make these videos because i know people make them and people watch them but i'm not one of those people that watches them and so when i make them i'm like what the like this is so funny like people who Like, just make sounds in the camera. Like, I'm like, are you fucking kidding me? But honestly, I'm really here for the view and the like and the follow, too. So, whatever. Whatever. Beep, bop, diddly, bop, beep, bop, I don't know what you want from me, so <laughs> I'll try everything. And this is me trying cribs. You should have seen my mukbang with my friend or my face. I keep saying face bang, that's so funny to me. Um, mask bang that I'm trying to start doing with my friend on my YouTube. YouTube's in the link anyways, if you wanna support your girl. Um, 
I'm done with all this BS. I really was thinking in my head I would say so many other fun, quirky, and cool things, but I didn't. So, the end. Like I said, I'm going to take my dog to the place, and then I'm going to this women's group with my girl, and I'm really excited. I love... I love that healing shit and magic stuff. I don't know. Anyways, ta-ta for now. Peace out.